how fun is this? This is so much fun. Look, we both wore red. I know. We look like one of those family holiday Aren't we pictures. Festive? <laughs> Welcome to our home. Anyway, we are so excited today. We've got three hours. It's we a do. special edition of our host pick, we and do. these are our favorite items. A lot of them, or most of them, that we did pick out as great ideas for um, for holiday gifts for you. We've got some really affordable stuff coming up in the show. We've got cooking. We've that's got it. everything. And that's what you and I wanted. We kind yeah. of wanted to bring things that, yes, sure, are great for you, but also for gift giving. You know, we want to make your life easier. Yeah. We want to give you options. Do keep in mind for Holiday Host Pick, every single thing airing and everything on hsn.com in our Holiday Host Pick pages, that's all on free on, on FlexPay. Yeah. So I was going to say free shipping. That's not true. A lot, on on a lot of a it's lot on free shipping. A lot of it's on free shipping, shipping too. But, but it's a wonderful opportunity. And by the way, you spend $75 today you are in free shipping. So that, there's where the cables got crossed. And you, and you better be spending $75 because we got great deals for you. You can, you can knock off a lot of people off that holiday list uh, with us today. So thank you for joining us. We're going to see you in a few seconds. I'm going to stay here because I'm going to eat pie. You're, you're not going to leave me? <laughs> I'm going to go. But, I, well, but I will be standing stay right there. Stay right there. Yes. I, all right. I'm not going anywhere right. when we're baking fresh all pies. Right. So, uh, <laughs> all right. Let's get started. Uh, one of my favorite items here at HSN, as you know, I, I grew up in the restaurant business, love to cook, is our uh, Holstein pie maker what i love about this is you can pay here's what it is it is seven to eight minutes to homemade pie that's how long it takes you don't have to put it in the oven for 45 minutes it cooks right in this little tabletop oven it's non-stick you cook two pies at a time and it could be sweet it could be savory it could be breakfast lunch dinner dessert it is so much fun so if you've got kids out there and you want to have fun with them or grandkids this is the way to do it your only thing you have to worry about is do i want a blue one or do i want a red one it comes with all the bells and whistles that you need including a little book with some great recipes carrie maletto is here i'm so glad to see you i'm so glad to this see is, you too we had so much fun. Let me tell you, the last time that I that we had this pie maker was June. Yes. It was you and I, and uh -huh. we sold it out. We did. It was 1995. I don't think it had free shipping. So right. we got free shipping, and it wasn't on FlexPay. Here's the thing. I got 1900 so it's kind of like off to the races here. Yeah. We love our pie maker. We love our pie maker. You know, when the pie maker came into my life, I just want to say this right off the bat. So much fun. You will get so creative with this. I have done pies that I never would have thought of at the beginning. Please, if you have any ideas of uh, things that you've done in your pie maker, let us know. Like, oh, you know what I mean? Because I think last time somebody mentioned something about like macaroni and cheese oh, or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. And what Unbelievable. So we're going to give you lots of ideas, but I want to come and I want to talk about how easy this is to use. Now, Holstein is all about making it easy and fun in the kitchen. Look at that. And with the pie maker, this is the time of year you are really going to get a lot of use out of this. The pies come as kind of like, and I, you know, I always like to show my hand next to it. Mm -hmm. It's great for portion control. It's great if you're a household that has one or two people in it, but it's also great if you're going to have a lot of people over because what's great about this is everyone can have their own individual pie. I love that. Pie. How cute so is this? So if you this? want a pecan pie, blueberry pie, apple pie, pumpkin pie, you can make them. You just buy the filling or make the filling ahead of time. That's right. You go get your ordinary pie yeah. dough that you can buy. I, we buy it like the rolled up stuff. Ready? And you just stick it in there and then you start making pies and in eight minutes you've got a pie. Look at <gasps> And it's See, now, piping hot. Piping hot. What you want is you want that nice crusty outside oh and you want it nice gosh. and soft and just, just go for it. Go for I'm gonna it. Go. I'm gonna, this now, is watch what this. you have to do. So you have to have the ice cream. Now I want you to think how many gatherings right we're gonna have people over around halloween time yeah. we're gonna have people over for thanksgiving time we're gonna have people over for the holidays mm. whether it's christmas or hanukkah or anything you're celebrating so you're gonna be prepared by having this because everybody that comes over can help you can do like an ice cream bar look at this cherry pie look at this cherry pie guys let me tell you it's already going very very fast free shipping it's only it's a 20 dollars bill you will use this throughout the holidays and throughout the year anytime you feel like having pie and it doesn't just have to be sweet pies you, you can take yes. things like you can make a pizza pie you can do eggs inside it. We're going to show you how to do all that, but show everybody how simple. Okay, so you know what? You can buy your pie your, your pie crust straight from the store in the frozen food section, or you can make it from scratch yourself. We are including a recipe should you like to do that. Um, so either way, make it super, super easy, or just if you like to you know, make yours from scratch, you can do that too. So you just place your bottom in, then you're going to put in your filling. Now, again, you can get filling in the store. Can I help you? Sure, sure. Or you can go ahead and get 
um, you make your own from scratch as well. So maybe if you have, you know, different fruit trees and you want to use, you have like an apple tree and you want to yeah. use your own apples, Look at by that. all means. Now you just lay this on top Are like we not that. having fun? We're having so much this fun. This is so much fun to do. Lay this on top, Look, right? Now it's got the little thing in it, right? So it's going to press it for you. So now this maker's non-stick top and bottom, which means you don't have to worry about any overflow or anything like that because it'll just pop right out. You're going to close it and lock it here. This indicator light lets you yeah. know when it's warmed See up. See the light on there? And that's it. Seven to ten minutes, we're going to come back and we're going to look at these pies. I can't wait. So now you were talking about savory and sweet. So yeah. we started with the sweet and what we think of for pies. But how about pop pies? Oh. Now... <laughs> All right, That's this my is where it's starting to get crazy. This is where it gets really awesome. And Watch the reason this. I love a pot pie is because it, you know, you can use every leftover that you have. So if you had some steaks that week or some chicken that week, you Look can go it. ahead and put that in your pot pie. Where the heck are all the forks? Now, <laughs> nobody uh -oh. gave me any. Oh, there they are. Oh, there I they knew are. you wouldn't let. Me. I knew you wouldn't crazy. leave me hanging, Joel. All there right, so what go. is Look this one? This. this is a chicken pot pie. Now, what we have done oh. is we have put the turmeric from our wakaya inside the yeah. chicken pot this pie. Is, this is the turmeric that's coming up in our little gift set with the yep. turmeric and the ginger. Yep. I don't know if you can see, there it is. So you're gonna get some turmeric and some ginger and you can see that turmeric in that. I have to try this. Please go for it. Oh, ridiculous. A little bit, little bit goes along. Oh my way. God, it's so good. Isn't that great? Okay, so and here we're going to pop these in. Mm. So look, I just want, again, I want you to think about the times that you went into the fridge and your leftovers went to waste because maybe there was only a little bit left and you're like, ah, oh, I can't do a whole meal with that. Well, guess what? You could have made a pie. Oh. So all you got to do is just pop in a few ingredients, whatever's in the fridge. Look at this. So we've got, the, this is the, the chicken pot pie and then we did a beef pot pie. We did a pie. beef. So same thing. We just pop this on top. Look at fill, how good that fill looks. Fill it to the top like that. Exactly. And Watch. then close her up. There we go. Now look. It's also coming it. with this piece here, and that's going to help you to go ahead if you want to make your pie crust from scratch. There's the bottom, there's a top part, yep. and then there's the bottom part, which is a little bit bigger. So you and just flip it over, it. and that comes with it. So here you go. So you would just use these to make your, each of your crusts for your pies. So simple. So All right, fast. now I can already see the steam coming out of one pie. <clears throat> so we've got so excited. So we've got some uh, dessert pies, and yep. we've got some dinner pies. What next are we going so to do? So it's breakfast. It's 6 a.m. So let's get started the right way um you know a lot of times whether it's yourself we get bored with breakfast right mm -hmm, i mean yeah. it can be like the same thing all well, the time or you get something out of the freezer that's never going to taste as good as this is can gang this is fresh that? you know what eight minutes things like pot pies and egg sandwiches and things like that when you buy them in the store what what's in them we don't know we don't know what preservatives are in there help me pull that out I, yeah here, apparently I, got, I need to get i need to grow a few inches it hasn't happened yet there i'm still is. waiting okay. is that a, is that a mushroom oh that's that sausage. sausage that's a big a, sausage at patty at the bottom so oh my gosh all you have to do <laughs> right okay so we're going to start and make one right now okay so all you have to do to change breakfast forever is to just place your bottoms in again easy peasy okay all right then you're two gonna, people can do this and have a really good time. Look at that. We're putting the breakfast sausage in. Put your breakfast sausage at the bottom. Okay. Then you're going to do some egg. Can I whatever do, kind of egg you like. Can you I do, do cheese too? Of course. You could do egg whites. You could do, you know. Look egg, at this. The, Are you kidding me? Look at this. Bacon. That a girl. Bacon this and sausage in the same is thing. It's breakfast, <laughs> everybody. Now look, you could leave it, if you wanted, you could leave it open or you can close it. Again, this gets as creative as you want to be. Close it up, lock it. Seven to ten minutes, we're going to come back. Okay, here's what I'll tell you. Red is the most popular right now. I now only have about 1,600 with the folks online. This is, this is going to sell out. It's just a matter of time. This is so much fun. I mean, think about it. You can wake up in the morning. You can plug this in. It's ready to go in, a, in, a, in just about two minutes. It heats up. Correct. Take your pie stuff, put it inside, put some eggs in, close it up, and in seven, eight minutes, you've got you've got the most delicious egg sandwiches. Yes. You could put bacon in there for lunch, Forget right? Forget about going to the drive-in. You could take macaroni stuff. and cheese and little sliced hot dogs, because I've done that before, and make a little... It's Danny's just like, dude, just throw them at me, like Frisbees. He's like, just keep them coming. <laughs> he loves that stuff, and I'm so much happier giving him that than something oh, that I'm buying... Because the microwavable stuff, it's convenient, but it what's never tastes it? as good as this. And what's in it? Okay. Listen, we don't want to put that in our bodies. Right. You want to do something? You're killing you know. me here. Okay, it's the My season, favorite pie. everyone. Look pecan it. pies. How so close we did, can we you did get? a baby pecan look pie. It. Look at how cute that is. Here, I'll hold it in my hand. It's, <laughs> it is very, it's hot. But look at that is a little mini pecan pie. So if you have people that one person likes pecan pie, one person likes apple, one likes pumpkin, one, one likes, likes pumpkin. cheesecake. 
How oh. beautiful is that? Can okay. I, I'm going to cut this one. Okay, please do. I want to show you. So now, this all you're going to do is leave the top pecan off. Pie. Okay, so when you make the pies, and it takes a few extra minutes um, when you leave the top okay. off. So it may be about 10 to maybe 12 minutes on the pies just to get them completely done. Oh, my God. Um, but, yes, you know, when my mom came over. Wow, look we at were, that. We were going to watch a movie. <laughs> we didn't have dessert made yet. And I said, you want to make a pie? And she was like, Okay, and yeah. we got so excited. We were like kids, like yeah. because it was like we came in there. We're like, what do we want to put in it? What do we want to make? You mm -hmm. know, and it was so much fun. And you could do this family time together. You can do this to be quick and fast. Whatever works for you. Here, guy, you mentioned how much you like a good chili. I, are you kidding me? <laughs> Leslie made my chili. <laughs> Jared's made my chili. I got. I got. I think I got that recipe right. uh, uh, available on .com. Look what I'm going to do now. Watch. We have our turmeric. Do it. And I am going to take a little extra turmeric. Okay. From, and this is what Leslie Perfect. has coming up. And I'm going to sprinkle some on. This stuff is so good. Awesome. And it's good for cheesy, you. Cheesy, cheesy. I'm going to put some of that in. Okay. And then we're just going to pop this on top. Boom. How much fun is okay. this? Okay. Next. Here we go. Getting even more creative. Oh, what are we, we doing? Another? There. Ooh. Here. Can I do it? Yep. So this is, uh, are you doing, this is kind of a vegetarian Spinacopita, one. Spinacopita, so it's kind of a Greek, it's a Greek idea, so you yeah. get feta cheese and spinach. Well, it's not vegetarian then, because it has the cheese in it, but who cares? Right. We love that anyway. So, <laughs> yeah, you can make it without cheese if you want. There you go, sure. But look at how beautiful that is. So, you know what? A little olive oil, put in whatever spices you enjoy. It's a little garlic, a little fresh garlic goes a long way on that. That's what happens, ready? Boom. Now, so now you'll we notice. we two different things in one yep. maker. You'll notice it locks, okay? And then yep. you'll see the lights on top. There's your indicator light. There's a recipe book inside. Correct. But the average that a pie takes anywhere from about six to ten minutes. It really depends on what you're making. Right. But most of them average out about seven or eight minutes. And that's for two quick pies. All right, it's on FlexPay. If you want to buy it today, it's free shipping. It wasn't free shipping the last time we had it, and it sold out then. It will sell out now. Red is out selling blue, but grab it. It comes with this little recipe book. Let me show you the, the actual unit itself again. I'll lean it over and tell you what you get. So this is nonstick. You can simply wipe these out with a towel at the end of the day. You don't need to wash them. You just wipe them out. You get the cutters, and this is to make the top, the top and the bottom. So you use one side to do the, the top, and then one side to do the right. bottom. Uh, and then you buy your ordinary dough comes with a little recipe book that's got some great ideas on, on how to uh, be able to utilize it it's a small profile takes up no space that's what i was just gonna say so actually it actually folds up and then you can just slide it right into a space I actually have a, a place in my uh cabinets where yeah. it just it is a place for stuff to slide so you can store this easily wherever you need to um, i know she's but what waiting i love is i kind of at this Come time on, of Leslie. year I'm, I'm, like keep a, I'm like a shark i'm like kind of doing like, the rounds which one do i'm I like when do i get to taste <laughs> no you you tell me what, what do i get to eat today so, you want to try this I would love this. Is this is, is this turkey pot pie so or chicken? This is a chicken chicken pot pie, right? I think we did chicken, so we, we change it up, and that's you're the thing. One. At this time of year, you're going to have probably a lot of turkey lying around. This is a great idea on how to use your leftover turkey. Great idea. Yeah. Because you know we get sick of the turkey sandwiches, that's right? That's right. Little extra something something. So again, idea: make a whole bunch of pies, make it pie Sunday, make a whole bunch of so pies, warm. put them in is the freezer, warm? Warm so that when you have so that day that you've worked a long day or you don't mm. want to make anything, you just pull it out of the freezer, heat it up when you're ready. Ready, and then that way you're good to go and you've made it you know what's inside I, I you know, love that fact. and yep. you know why I like this too because uh, guy and I were talking about this in the makeup room I like that Liam who is six years old mm -hmm. can now get off his tablet or get off the TV mm -hmm. and not sit there and actually get involved in the kitchen with me and do something out of the box and yeah. create together you know instead of just cutting a sheet of construction mm -hmm. paper now we're actually cooking something together and enjoying it you know what's really important too is that because mm -hmm. we you know we have kids is that I can't tell you how many times in a week where, you know, most people will go and they get fast food for their kids because like with Dan, mm. he's got baseball, he's got yeah. this, and you can't cook a meal because you don't have an uh -huh. hour to do it. Right. Uh -huh. you, can make, you can make homemade meals. And I know a lot of us, as parents, a lot of us out there are like, I feel guilty when I don't make a homemade meal a couple times a week. This is so easy because you buy the dough. You can even buy the filling. Yeah. I mean, you can buy chicken pot pie filling. You can do all that. But if you've got leftovers, throw them in there. And now you get that sense of, look what mommy made for you. Mm -hmm. Look what daddy made. Absolutely. Let's make one together. And get mm -hmm. creative, so too. I mean, it's like, you yeah. know, like I said, someone last time was talking about a lobster mac and cheese. You can go ahead and do, I think you were talking something about crab last time. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. You, Whatever you got. You can make crab cake filling and stick it in there. When it's got a crust on it, oh, my gosh. Let's and it's so not good. here. It's not the ordinary sandwich. It's not the drive through it's Let, just thinking yeah. differently. Let's show a live Let's one. See. Okay, so we're getting there Almost on these, there. guys. So it's going to go ahead and finish up on the top, and then that's going to be... And I want to point out something here real quick. 
Yeah. Um, you see how, like, on the edges it kind of went over? Yeah, the it just cuts I, away. I said, don't worry there, about see? it. See, just Boom, comes right it off. It just flies right off. So, guess what? It makes you the perfect baker. Okay, let's check these We're guys continuing over on. Here. Before we do that, I want to go to our phones. I'm going to say hi to Carol. Carol is in New York, and she ordered three of them, and she got all of them in red. Hi, Carol. Mm -hmm. Hi, how are you? Wonderful. Welcome into HSN. So tell me, why did you buy a, buy a pie maker today? Or three of well, them? Well, I thought the creativity was very exciting. I was, I'm a retired teacher and right. I love to be creative. Yeah. And not only that, it's a great Christmas gift. And I yeah. bought two for friends and one for myself. Great idea. Yeah. <laughs> Great idea. Carol, look what we made. We just made, that's how fast. We made a chicken pot pie and a beef pot pie in about seven minutes. <laughs> yeah, I love the fact that if I have my girlfriends over for lunch, yeah. uh, it's real easy, it's quick, and here we go. Yeah, and you know what else, Carol? Like, pot pie is kind of an old-fashioned food, but it's very upscale now because, you know, what's old is new and it's kind of hip. You're hanging out with your girls and you're <laughs> eating chicken pot pie. What's better than that? Everyone loves well, Minnie. Well, a nice presentation, and they think you did a lot of work. And well, one, darling, two, thank you so much, and you enjoy and those. Thanks, Carol. All right, okay, here's look. what I'll tell you. I've got uh, about 1,000 left, so half the quantity is already gone. How many, Jared? 500 left in red. By the way, the ginger is coming up, and we sprinkled that on our pie. So you can apple, use ginger and pecan pie. You can use an apple pie, Ginger, pie. wait for it. What are you doing there? A little caramel. Oh, you're not putting caramel inside that pie. Ginger, caramel, apple. You want, to, you want me to do the move? What? He's got to do it. He promised me he would do this. I told her to do this. All right, so anytime is a great time for pie. That's my move. Yeah. That's it. You know what I mean? <laughs> That's it. Oh, God. I'm like, wait, he's trying to put it there. He's right. going to fall over. Carrie Maletto, you're amazing. Oh, so are you. You little pie maker here. <laughs> I love her.